Hey, uh, this is Corey Rindler for, and this is the breadboard project for audio electronics. We have a breadboard here, nine volt battery. Um, I, pl I pulled, I plugged in the thing on top. The black's negative, red's positive. So, so you can see what I'm doing. Here's the breadboard. I'm gonna plug in the black into this red, this blue column. Okay, so the electrons are now traveling that way. We have a resistor here. Uh, you need like 380 to for the LED, and I couldn't find one that was too close. So this one's blue, gray, brown, gold. So that's six. Uh, that's uh, 680 plus or minus 5%. Um, so I plug that in on the same row, the blue. I don't know why I moved that up. And then I'm going to plug that in into, well, I guess it's in the column. I'm going to plug it into row 15. All right. So then I have my TRS cable plugged in the two TRS ends. It was hard finding ones that were any good. A lot of them were broken off or just destroyed um, when we got here. I got So I'm going to first plug in the sleeve, the middle one, to the same row, 15, as the resistor. So the electrons are now traveling in the sleeve from this one. So I'm going to take the middle one from the other side and plug it into, um, why not, row 20. Yeah, that'll work. F F F twenty is where it's going. I twist it up so it fits without getting all scrunched up. <sighs> all right, so it's down in there. Hopefully that. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. So now it's in there for sure. And then I'm going to do the, um, this is the tip next. I'm going to plug that in the same row. It's going into J20. So then it's gone through on the sleeve, and now it's going to come back on the tip. So then I take the other side again and take its tip and plug it into A25. Five. I hope you can be seeing what I'm doing. Oh, came undone. I gotta plug it back in. All right. So a twenty-five, and then I'm gonna put, and then I'm gonna do the ring in that same row. So it's e twenty-five. So then it's coming back through, and then we have it on the ring on the other side. That's going into f fifteen. Now, all we should have to do is plug the LED from f fifteen. I mean, not J15, into the other side of the column, the other column. I haven't plugged in the battery there yet, so that's why. And then I should be, plug this, the positive end of the battery, and the electrons should have flowed the right way through all of it. Yep, yep, and there it goes. I don't know if you can see, I don't even know if you can see the LED. Oh, it's right there. Yep, see it's on? So it's gone from the negative side of the battery into the sleeve of this one, into the sleeve of this one, from that to the tip, back through to the tip of this one, and then to the ring of this one, to the ring of this one, into the LED, and then into the battery. So it goes negative positive, and I've got it to work. Um, so, yeah, so that's my project. I hope I, you enjoyed my video, and thanks for watching.